As we begin the new year, we take time to reflect on Mary. Mary is truly a gift, a person who, through her her kindness, her love, her commitment, leads us. The best gift, of course, is Christ himself. And the Church honors the woman through whom the gift came into the world, Mary. And just as Mary had to reflect upon what she heard and experienced, so we must devote time and attention to realize more fully whom we have been given, Christ. Far beyond anyone's expectation, Mary gave birth not simply to the long-awaited Messiah. She gave birth to the Son of God, the Son of God. So it's not simply good news, it's the best news. God loves us more than we can imagine. Like Mary who brought Jesus into the world, we are commanded to bring Christ into our world. We need to share the best news ever. A story. A young boy and girl wanted to see the circus. They heard it was in town and was coming soon. They asked their parents, can we go? They said, do your chores and then you can go. And they did them quickly and went downtown. And they stood on the street corner. And first of all, the band came by playing wonderful, wonderful music. And then the elephants walked by. They were so impressed. They loved it. And then the cages with the, uh, the lions and the tigers came by. And then all of a sudden the horses and bareback riders were in the procession, in the parade. Then the jugglers, the clowns, and they had these little cars that they ran around and it was funny and they enjoyed them. And then came the ringmaster in his red coat and his top hat and the boy and girl ran out to him so excited and said, thank you. Thank you for the circus. And they went home. They did not know there was more. They thought the parade was the circus. So they missed the big top, the big show. They missed the three rings. They missed the main event. And that can happen to us. Christmas, this season is so beautiful. You know, there's so many exciting moments, writing Christmas cards, getting gifts and giving gifts, decorating the house, how wonderful those occasions are, and putting up the tree and putting the special decorations on, the family meal and the gathering together as family, the singing of Christmas carols, all part of the parade that brings joy and happiness to Christmas. And sometimes we get so caught up in that parade that we miss the main event. The main event is that God loves us. This time of the year we know that God loves us more than we can realize. And at this time in history, Mary said yes to God, and she gave birth to Jesus, the Savior. She participated completely in God's love by saying yes and birthing the Son of God. Jesus, his Son, teaches us more than we can realize 
He teaches us how to love and have compassion for others, even when the world teaches us to be self-centered and self-seeking. Jesus teaches us how to forgive and have mercy when the world wants to hold grudges, remember faults, and be judgmental. Jesus teaches us to seek peace even when the world offers so much chaos and violence and even war. We honor Mary, the mother of God, and she does not want us to miss the main event. So we pray to her and ask her to help us on our journey of life, that we can know her son more and more, and through knowing him, we also change our world. We make it more peaceful, more hopeful, filled with love, and more joyful. May your new year have those gifts.